All right, so here's uh, the Alaska SDMI uh, best data uh, layer that they actually give out using WMS, which is kind of great. As you can see right here, we have some super high-res stuff. This is the medium layer stuff. So let's just turn that off. All right, perfect. High-res stuff right there. I'm just going to scroll just a little bit. All right, so that's the benefit of caching right there, is that minute movements, not a big deal. Um, in fact, I went ahead and preceded the cache a little bit. If I zoom in, there we go. We're getting a mixture of misses and hits. Some of the misses are up here. But if I scroll around, nice and fast. Doesn't bug me too much. And QGIS gets to get on with its life. It has a difficult time sometimes being asynchronous with uh, requests. There, I just zoomed in again. No big deal. Uh, however, uh, if it's not cached, of course, it takes a little while because my internet is super slow at my house. Uh, but I can cancel that just by zooming back out again. Sometimes canceling, not so good. QGIS does not understand the whole concept of, oh, I no longer have to fetch this. Um, so I'd be interested in looking at the source a little bit and helping deal with that. But I think it does it for the purpose of caching it later on. All right, so there was uh, some areas that actually had high resolution content. See right there, we grabbed uh, a whole bunch of tiles that were already pre-cached. All right, so let's go ahead and zoom in on, well, see, I moved to a smaller screen and now all of my stuff is hiding. Zoom in on this bit, best data layer over here. Dunka, 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 dunka. And there it is. All right, nice and fast this time around. So ideally, in Shane's imaginary world of stuff that's awesome, uh, we would be grabbing the higher res versions of this and then just downscaling it, which would require a more active proxying method. Um, that way it says, hey, you know, uh, the actual native resolution is going to be this. So why don't I just go ahead and grab everything at a native resolution? Um, and then uh, you can actually just explore around a lot faster. So that's what I intend on doing is making a WCS, WFS, WMS proxy at some point in, in the near future. Um, to kind of speed up a lot of the stuff because when you're doing GIS work from home, um, yeah, it's no, it's no fun when, when you end up having a ton of data to work with. See, I zoomed in way too far and I have no idea what it's doing now. Why it would be downloading this many um, individual tiles is just beyond me. All right, we're done. All right, I guess I broke it, folks.